remember what the haters talking about. What's up, family? I see the gatekeepers are out in full force, trying to protect the co-gatekeepers, Oprah Winfrey and Gayle King, from the backlash they received from the black community for Gayle King's Lisa Leslie interview. Let me tell you straight out the gate, it ain't gonna work. They're saying things like, why are black people going after Gayle King with so much venom when they didn't do the same for the white woman who worked at the Washington Post when she posted a link to Kobe Bryant's sexual assault case. This is rudimentary, man. We expect that from them. We expect more from people who share our same hue. When black people are elevated, we in the black community expect a return on our investment for our support in the form of being given a fast shot on a historically unleveled playing field. We're not asking for any type of special treatment. Just don't do us like they would. They say, how can you judge them based on one event? One event? Have you been living under a rock? Oprah and Gail have a penchant for dragging black men exclusively. Well, Oprah's giving millions of dollars to black men and boys in Chicago and at Morehouse. <laughs> Giving money is not an affirmation of good character, nor is it an indication that you love someone. A pimp will wine and dine a woman. Next thing you know, you have her out there on the track and beating her head in. The government of the United States give millions of dollars to impoverished black people every year. And you know how they feel about us. There are those who say, well, Kobe wrote a letter to the victim apologizing. Why would he do that for such a serious crime if he was not guilty? Uh, how about in this country, the United States of America, every single day, thousands of defendants are coerced into plea bargaining to crimes they did not commit because the penalty for exercising their constitutional rights are just too great to risk. Yes, absolutely yes. Black women have always been there for black men. Collectively, black women have always had our backs. That's why I have their backs. That is why I will always defend the black woman. But I'm not so naive. I'm not so emotional where I just look at color and give somebody a pass. An enemy is an enemy. I love black women with a passion, but no mammy formed against me shall prosper. No more talk. What the haters talking about? Yeah.